Hi everyone, this is Diego at Detail and today I want to show you my super simple setup to live stream on two platforms at once using just a phone, a microphone and a tripod. That's it, this is all you need. So this setup is perfect if you want to stream your reaction to a YouTube video, a Netflix show or even gaming. I am using both cameras of my phone the back camera is gonna capture whatever is on the TV screen and the front camera is gonna film my reaction. So the result looks something like this. So if you wanna get this done with very minimum equipment, this is what you need to do. The first thing I wanna talk about is the equipment. This is what you need. Again, very simple. So I'm gonna use a very simple tripod. This is a phone tripod. Any of these will do as long as it's sturdy enough. Then we have my phone with the detail app and lastly, we have a USB-C microphone. I have this wired one, but you can use a wireless as well. One last thing that you need is your laptop. We do need to have that laptop handy because we will need the live stream keys from whatever platform you're gonna be streaming to. All right, so now let's talk about the setup, right? So make sure you are sitting in front of your TV and you're gonna mount your phone on a tripod in front of you. So we do need to have both cameras synced, right? So I'm gonna put my tripod right in front of me, just like this. And then I'm gonna place my phone right in front of me, making sure that both cameras are looking at the right direction. For this thing, I am using my PlayStation to open YouTube on my TV, but you can use any console or streaming device. All right, so next, once we have the phone ready, we're gonna open detail on your phone, and then we're gonna connect the microphone. We're gonna open a project, and we're gonna make sure that you see this thing right here because that means that your microphone is connected. So what we're gonna do next is we're gonna set up the layout in the detail app, right? So here we have the project. What you're gonna do next is go to layout and then you have a couple of different layout options. You can do a 70-30, you can do a split screen, you can do a bubble, or you can do what I'm gonna do right now, which is place yourself in the corner and then I'm gonna tap here and I'm gonna mask my background. So once you have the layout sorted, you're gonna align your phone so you are in frame, just like here, and your TV is clearly visible. So what I do here is I zoom in and reposition everything until it's perfect and it's the way I want it. There you go, that's it. So whether it's a game, Netflix, YouTube, have your content ready on the TV. Okay, so what we're gonna do next, we're gonna get our stream keys from our laptop. So remember, we need to have the laptop and the web browser ready. So I have right here, YouTube and Twitch. So first, let's get YouTube, right? So we're gonna go to YouTube. What you need to do is go to create, then go live. In right here, you're gonna get your stream key. You need to copy that. And then on your phone, on detail, you're gonna tap the live icon. You're gonna select YouTube and you're gonna paste that live stream key right there. So we have YouTube sorted. Then you go to Twitch or whatever platform you're gonna live stream to and it's gonna be the same thing. You're gonna go to stream and you're gonna copy the live stream key that you see right there. You're gonna select on your phone Twitch and paste the stream key. That's it, we are pretty much ready to go. All right, so we can start streaming once everything is set you're just gonna tap go live on your phone. Once that is done, you're gonna see on your screen for both YouTube and Twitch live streaming at the same time. There might be a bit of a lag, so keep that in mind, but it works great. And that is it, now I can just use my PlayStation to open any video that I want on YouTube just like this and live stream my reaction. Remember, I can do a YouTube video, I can go to Netflix, I can just play a game. I can live stream my reaction to whatever I have in front of me. It is very simple. And as you can see, the setup is very much something that you might already have at home. And that is it. Now it is your turn to live stream and connect with your audience. So I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, you can always drop me a comment. I am here to help. And do not forget to subscribe for more content. And also just to remind you, you can find the detail app on the App Store. I will catch you on the next one.